Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks to Senator Parker and our own Shira. Yeah. I really and sincerely thank you for doing this and for using this space. Um, again, Sheree Fraser, the district manager of the community board sympathy. But before I get into what we usually what we do as a community board, for the past, I would say over ten years, we've been advocating for this library for funding. We've attended so I attended so many meetings, there were so many setbacks. Uh, our public advocate who was then the council member, we worked diligently. And one of the things that I'm especially proud of, when the library was closed, we insisted that the employees remain in this library and that throughout the construction, they get their salary, they were on the payroll, and so thank you for taking up where um, uh, our now public advocate, Jemani Williams, left off, and for making this a reality. This is truly a special place in our community, and thank you very much. Yes, so um, Community Board 17 is the first step to city government. Um, what do we do? We are responsible for service delivery to the community. Uh, we advocate with all the city agencies for service to you, to our residents here in this district of East Flatbush. Um, we have our community board meetings are held every third Wednesday of each month. Uh, for the past two years, because of the pandemic, we've been holding our meetings virtually. Uh, we're hopeful that we could continue doing that until September. Um, I know that our city council and our elected officials are advocating for us to remain, uh, have virtual meetings until September, and we keep our fingers crossed. Usually our meetings are held at Scooby downstairs. <laughs> a matter of fact, I just sent her a letter uh, a few days ago requesting to use the auditorium. Um, we've been meeting there for the past 20 plus years, but because of the pandemic, I want to need to help virtually. So, any complaint that you have in the community, um, feel free to uh, contact the office. We're located at 4112 Farragut Road. Our um, uh, telephone number is 718. Let me make sure I don't give out my phone number. 718 434 3702. Give us a call. Any complaint that you have. We're there to answer. It's myself and three staff members that runs the office. If I'm not there, there, they could take care of your complaint. And one of the things that I find when I come out and I greet the public, every time that they someone calls the office, they ask to speak to me. But I have a competent staff that handles the work of the board also. Sabrina, it's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, I, I, I think this is the first time you've been first in person. Time. The very first, first time. time in person. The very first time in person. We've been communicating for such over, what, two oh, years? Two right years? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I've been communicating with Sabrina, a diligent worker, uh, someone that I can depend on. When the council member is not there, she's always there answering the phone to ensure. As a matter of fact, I think she spoke twice to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to ensure that the work of the community, and this is not just one person, this is a collaborative effort, and I want to say congratulations to all you beautiful honorees. Thank you for the work that you do, you did and continue to do in our community. It's because of you that we could get up every morning and, to, and know that you are there. When we cannot be there, you're our eyes and ears. I get up and I go to the office, you're out there and you call. The small, June, my goodness, it is a pleasure. Thank you for all the work that you continue to work through the pandemic. Uh, it was such a difficult time for the community. Again, thank you to each and every one of you, and thanks to the friends and supporters for coming out and supporting the Shiro that we honor this evening. Ms. Kwok, another one of our Shiro, that's always there, making sure that our community the, the Caribbean paper is out there. She's always there ensuring that whatever happens in, in our little small area that it's in the Caribbean news. So thank you. Thank you, Dr. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
friend, if you want to highlight any work that you do, reach out to her. Uh, and seriously, she has been doing this for quite some time. Again, thank you. Thank you so much for giving me the time.